Thank you everyone for visiting our Facebook site on RES Aquaculture. Uh, today I'm going to show you a quick video on the protein schema that we recently just built. Uh, as you can see, it consists of a 6 inch body and air is actually introduced in the system by, via two methods. Uh, mainly, it's a venturi with a pump and followed by an air blower. So the targeted air flow rate should be around 50 liters per minute uh, and the flow rate into the protein schema is about 4 tons an hour. So as you can see, how does the protein schema work? Essentially the protein schema is used to clear out the fine particulates in the water as well as some of the dissolved proteins in the water. So the air bubble basically entrains up to the column and picks up all the dirt and it is filtered out into an overflowing tray. So as you can see, the water that is accumulated on the side has actually highly solidified waste. So taking into account the liquid that is actually treated by the protein schema, uh, we can see here it actually only contains uh, micro dissolved bubbles and not much of a solid. Uh, meaning that it has a low turbidity content as opposed to the incoming water supply that has you can see floating particulates so I would say with this protein schema set up you can actually reduce the amount of fine protein solid dissolved in the water and make your and reduce the amount of uh, bacterial oxygen consumption because essentially you have reduced the amount of protein dissolved in the water uh, the total setup for this protein schema it only costs about three to four hundred ringgit, uh, which translates to about one hundred US dollar, and it is sized up to about two point two two to two point five kilo of feed every day. So uh, for an ideal feed of about five kilo a day, you are looking at about a twelve inch schema along with one hundred liters per minute of air flow going through the system. So that's all for today. Uh, we hope to catch you another day on RSA Aquaculture.